And part of my responsibility was finding uh, sort of co-founders that was complementary. I was very lucky. Uh, two of my co-founders, Amadeus and Courtney, are just rock solid on product and design. And even though I had some design background, I gave that up. I said, hey, you guys take this because I'm entrusting you with this and I'm empowering you with this. And you guys, uh, similarly, I feel will empower me with the, the business side of the, 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 the startup as well. So we got very lucky with that. We had a great co-founding unit when we started. And that's one of the ways that we were able to help focus on things that really mattered and that we were really strong at. Make sure you, you spend enough time with customers because a lot of people do get stuck in sort of what they think people want. And yes, there's one guy in the world that did this and became incredibly wealthy, which is Steve Jobs, but you're not Steve Jobs. So go and talk to your customers. And the stealth thing kind of works sometimes, but just talk to people about it. It's not like they're going to go run off and steal your idea and all of a sudden there's a company tomorrow that's doing what you're doing. It's not going to happen. If you casually mention components and be like, hey, do you guys, would, you, would this be cool? Like, does that work? Da, da, da. You'll get it immediately and just do the, the research, have them do the work for you almost. Like, and that's the funnest part is you get the response and you sometimes get very valuable advice, but don't dwell on one answer. Make sure you're able to detect trends so that, again, you're not uh, you know, throwing yourself in random directions with no particular reason. Best part about the conference so far is seeing all the people that I hang out with in San Francisco up here. It's just refreshing, and it's every year. This is like my third year here, but I come up because my family's here, and it's just it's a great uh, sight to see that you know all of the people that you know I know is considered in the Silicon Valley sort of crew is starting to become exposed to Vancouver. So I think that's a that's a really big deal. There's one about the art of the pitch. Uh, less for me and I think it's just more helping others because pitching journalists and pitching VCs is not a science, it's an art and I think people need to realize that it's sometimes really simple things like just relationship building and being a nice person uh, and I think journalists are humans too which is why people, people don't really realize this sometimes and they dump a whole giant essay when they first pitch about their company and it's like would you actually appreciate receiving a thousand word essay about a company and then it being expected to write up about it? Like, is that how you kind of want to do stuff? No. So I hope this panel actually covers stuff like that and I think it would be very helpful for people.